this is the Wispy 360-EVB-Mini version and we're going to connect this to the PC using a micro USB cable and the LED will turn on upon connecting and the USB driver will be automatically installed onto your PC now let's open device manager and look for the port number so under ports you'll see the port number is COM20 and um, if you can't find this port number you'll have to remove the USB cable and search for this driver name at Google so silicon labs CP210X USB down load. Okay, so click on this result. You'll get different versions that will work for uh, different operating systems. So install the appropriate one that will work with yours. And once you've done that, We'll have to reconnect the USB cable and then look for the port number. Once you've got the port number, let's open Arduino IDE. You can also use a different uh, serial terminal program if you wish to, but our tutorial will be based on Arduino IDE. Go to Tools, look for port, select COM20. Let's close this real quick. And click on this button which is the serial monitor and then minimize this also set the speed of the serial terminal to 115,200 BPS and select both NL and CR now let's type in AT <coughs> you got an OK message and now you're ready to send AT commands to the eval board. So you can also press this uh, reset button, which is located on the bottom left of the eval board. Let's try to press it, and you've got the ready message here. So it's just another way of preparing the UART communication. And now I'm going to uh, set the eval board to station mode, uh, station mode, and connect it to the uh, Wi-Fi AP. So to set station mode, type AT plus CWMODE underscore CUR equals one. <coughs> okay. And to enable DHCP, type AT plus CWDHCP underscore CUR equals one comma one okay so um, now we have enabled DHCP to sign to assign the IP from the Wi-Fi access point and now let's type in AT plus C W L A P to search for a connectable Wi-Fi access point Look for the one that your PC is um, connected to and once you've located it type in <coughs> AT plus CW JAP underscore CUR equals then quotation mark and uh, the SSID of your Access point dash five six D A dash two point four. Close it with a quotation mark and then comma another quotation mark and then the password. And then don't forget to close it with a quotation mark. Okay. Okay. So, you, 
once you're connected then type again this command at plus c i p s t a underscore c u r question mark <clears throat> now you've got uh, ip of the eval board and next for tcp communication connect the pc to the same wi-fi access point let's double check where it connected to the same one yep and um, yeah let's run the cmd prompt now so once you've opened that we're going to configure the ip of the pc you can see it here so let's put it here and um, type ping minus four space IP of the eval board uh, which was 10.1.10.162 you can find it here so press enter and you'll receive these replies in order to send a ping from the eval board to the PC type at plus p i n g or actually no plus p i n g equals quotation mark and then the ip of the pc 10.1.10.160 and close it with a quotation mark okay so Now all the network settings for the TCP communication are set and let's run the Hercules tool. Again, if you don't have the Hercules tool, you'll just have to search it at Google to download it. Uh, make sure to complete the search with Hercules download instead of just Hercules. Otherwise you'll get a bunch of images of Hercules instead of this results and install Hercules so yeah okay so with the Hercules go to TCP server and enter any port number except the reserved port numbers I'll be using 3000 and then click listen go back to the Arduino IDE and enter at plus c i p s t a r t equals and then quotation mark t c p quotation mark comma and then another quotation mark i p of the p c which was ten point one point ten point one sixty close it comma and then no quotation mark the port number which was 3000 this is the port number too. okay so then you can see the connection messages here on the Hercules and both IDE now let's transmit a TCP data uh, go go back to Hercules and I'm going to just send hello which since it's already here uh, click on this instead of pressing enter and then once the eval board receives the hello message or the data it will show up here <coughs> conversely to send data from the eval board to the TCP server type at plus c i p s e n d b u f equals 5 okay so 5 means the size of the data right here and hello is 5 characters so you can set actually you can actually you can set the size of the data from 1 to uh, 2048 bytes then you'll see the greater sign here the terminal 
which is uh, sent back from the eval board, meaning it's ready for uh, TCP data, transmitting TCP data. So let's enter again, hello, now this time in the IDE. Okay, so uh, since hello is five characters, you'll see it here that it's received. Okay, so and then also the send OK message here at the serial terminal. And once the tra uh, all these data transmission is done, go back to the ID and type AT plus CIP COLSE to disconnect the TCP communication. So now it's closed. Okay, so this is the end of the tutorial. Thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, um, you can leave your questions at forum that wiznet that io this is an official forum that is operated by wiznet and their engineers and uh, wiznet users so go to the wi-fi module section and wis 5360 and yeah you can leave questions here thanks again